Hi and welcome to another Instrument Show support video. In this video we'll demonstrate how straightforward it can be to measure the light levels in your workplace. Lighting from natural and or artificial sources needs to be provided for employees to ensure working conditions are safe and adequate for the work type being performed. This graph provides some examples of the Australian standards for the recommended illuminates for various types of office activity. As you can see, the more difficult the task, the higher the recommended lux level. Measuring around the instrument choice office, we expect to have lux levels ranging from 240 to over 400 lux. Inadequate office lighting may cause visual discomfort, headaches and more. On the other hand, optimal office lighting is attributed to better performance and lower levels of eye strain. When you want to measure light levels, it's critical to determine the best light meter for your needs, as not all light meters measure all types of light. A good example is LED light. To measure the lux levels around the office, I'm using the IC TTV335 due to its wide lux measurement range, adjustable color temperature, and photodiodes which are sensitive to artificial light, making it suited for measuring LED lighting, which we have here. When the correct light meter for your application is selected, measurements are straightforward. To determine the lux value, remove the sensor cap and place the light intensity meter onto the surface you wish to observe. For work settings, this will be on the work surface, such as a desk. Measuring the horizontal working area will provide an accurate representation of the light intensity reflected in the person's eyes when the surface is in use. Record the measurement, being sure that your body is not accidentally shading the sensor at any stage. Our writing desk has a lux level of between 392 to 403, which is pretty spot on. A second desk with the lights switched off is, as you can imagine with the lights switched off, lower than the ideal lux level. This level would likely be too low for prolonged use and could result in eye strain. Where the working area is unknown, for example train rooms or any desk free work areas, measure at a constant height from the floor, around 75 centimetres. And if the working area is large, it's handy to have a meter with minimum and maximum data retention so that you can get a good overall idea of the light in the entire work area. And that's how to ensure light levels are adequate in your home or office. For more information on light meters or for help finding the best light meter for your application, speak with an instrument choice scientist. Call 1300 737 871 or see the additional contact details in the video description. We hope that you found this video helpful. Thanks for watching.